guys, Courtney Rolston here. I hope you're well. Tonight I'm sharing with you my slow cooked pork and lemongrass curry. It's gonna fill your home with the most amazing aromas and at under $5 per serve, it's a great value, flavor pack recipe for you guys to whip up at home. Here's how we do it. The first thing we need to do is just to blitz up our aromatics for the curry paste. First thing is lemongrass. And I'm just gonna give the lemongrass a head start because it can be a little bit fibrous if it's not broken down. All right, next into the blender is just the remaining aromatics for our spice base. Give that a little pinch of salt. We're just gonna blend this until we have a beautiful, smooth paste. We now need to fry off this paste. So this is going in to the pan with the oil. All right, you just wanna cook out the paste for about two or three minutes. Next ingredients, curry powder. I've got 800 grams of pork shoulder here. So this is a recipe for four and I've just cut it up into kind of two centimetre chunks. All right, some seasonings now. I've got some fish sauce going in. To offset that saltiness, I've got just a tablespoon of honey. And to slow cook the pork, we need to get some moisture in our pan. So I'm just going to put enough water to cover the pork. Pop a lid on. I don't have a lid, but I have a bowl which will do the same job. Okay, the curry has had an hour, so let's have a little peek in here. Amazing, look at that. So the potatoes are gonna go in now. These are gonna need around 25, 30 minutes, and then I'm gonna pop in the beans. All right, the perfect thing to go with this curry is some beautiful steamed rice. Bring that up to the boil. As soon as the water's evaporated, pop a lid on and let it steam for around 15 minutes. All right, we are getting close to the finishing line. I've got some coconut cream. I like it spicy, this is optional, but I'm putting on some extra green chilies over the top. A little squeeze of lime is gonna add a beautiful bit of acidity and brightness to our curry. And you can top this with whatever herb you like. I love some coriander, so I'm going in with some coriander sprigs. There we have it guys, you wouldn't find a simpler curry to make humble ingredients, great value for money. That is how you make my slow cooked pork and lemongrass curry. For loads more What's For Dinner recipes, head on over to coles.com.au. I tell you what, this might not be a curry in a hurry, but some things are worth the wait. Oh yeah, that's a cracking curry.